Hello and welcome to another session on speed maths. And now uh, we are learning how to multiply two digit numbers which are near 100. In the previous two sessions, we saw how to multiply numbers which are just less than 100 or just above 100. So both the numbers were either just less than 100 or both of them were just above 100. In this session, we are going to take up the case 3 and that case is when one of them is Let's say you're doing this multiplication where a is greater than 100 and b is less than 100 then how to do it faster okay so examples would be let's say you are multiplying 97 to 103 the process remains almost the same right so 97 how far or what is the difference between 97 and 100 and that is minus 3 so you have to check the sign as well so basically you don't you're doing the number minus 100 Similarly here, 1 not 3 minus 100 is simply 3, correct? So this is plus 3 away from 100, that 97 is minus 3 away from 100. So I understood, I hope you understand what it, what it means. Now guys, when you repeat the process, now you have to multiply these numbers. So minus 3 times plus 3 is minus 9. But then minus 9 cannot be written in the product. So what to do? So the moment I see minus 9, what I do is I subtract 9 from 100 so what should i add or uh, you know if i if i add 100 to it so just add 100 to this number just add 100 so the moment you add 100 you will get 91 isn't it 91 okay now how many hundreds did you add just keep a count so you just made you know uh, one you added 100 so let me write this one here okay now what now repeat the process so 103 minus 3 is 100 0, 0. but since you have taken 100 out so you have to just subtract so whatever you get as a sum so hence the sum is 100 0, 0. so you have to reduce this one from here so it will be 100 minus 1 that is 99 so this is the product 9991 okay i hope you understood otherwise let's take another example for more clarity okay another one so let's say you are taking 96 and 104 similar numbers okay here you'll get minus 4 and here you'll get plus 4 isn't it now plus 4 minus 4 is minus 16 right it's minus 16 i just need to add only 100 right to make it a positive digit two digit number so add 100 so write this one here so add 100 how much you get 84 isn't it now you do the same process 96 plus 4 is 100 but since you borrowed 100 already so you have to so 96 plus 4 is 100 so i'm doing this i will not be writing all these steps while doing it it is just for you to understand so 96 plus 4 is 100 but there was one one here so remove that one and you get 9984 is the product right another one another one let's say i have 95 multiplied by 104 okay 95 multiplied by 104 so what do you get you get minus 5 and plus 4 right multiply minus 20 right add 100 to it and this will be 80 and 1 you write here then you do this operation 95 plus 4 is 99 take away this one so 98 so the product is 9880 okay i hope you're following this another one 96 into let's say 109 okay so here minus 4 here plus 9 correct so 9 into 4 minus 36 right and then plus 100 you add it to make it positive you'll get 64 right 64 and this one has to be counted here because now when i'm doing this 96 plus 9 or 109 minus 4 whichever you your choice so 109 minus 4 is 105 then take away this one from here so 105 minus 1 is 104 so this is the product 10464 now what happens if the you know uh, uh, you know the number to be added is more than 100 so you take you learn that as well so let's take an example of such cases for example i am doing 91 into 112 this is the multiplication I have to do. So 91 is 9 away, right? And 112 is 12 away. Now, if you see 12 times 9 is how much? 
108 so minus 108 okay now if you add 100 still it will be a negative number so hence minimum you have to add 200 out of it 200 to it right if you add simply 100 you will get minus 8 so you have to add 200 right so if you add 200 what will you get you will get 92 these will become the last two digits of the product 92 but since you added 200 so keep 2 here and now do the same process 112 minus 9 is 103 but you have to take away this 2 from here so 101 this is the product once again what did i do i multiplied 9 and minus 12 so the moment i did it i got minus 108 but i have to make it positive i can't have negative number in the product of two positive numbers so i have to I have to add multiples of 100 so if i add simply 100 still it will not help so hence i am adding 200 twice of 100 so when i add 200 i will get 92 200 to 108 minus 108 will get you 92 but in that process you have borrowed 200 so i'm just writing 2 here and then i repeat the process where i add 112 to minus 9 so i get 103 and then take away this 2 from it to get 101 so 103 minus this 2 is 1019 right and 10192 is the final answer correct now uh, during understanding it might take a little bit of more time to you know getting yourself acclimatized to the process but if you do multiple number of times i'm sure you will be able to ace it and you will be able to do it much faster so after this you can try the practice sessions on our plat lms and then you will be you know better equipped with these techniques